The funeral industry is one that's responded exceptionally well to what was asked of it, which was to make death go away. In the West, death is invisible. Even when we hear about it on the news, it's always a statistic or a number, but it's never in front of us. So the questions are usually the same. They're, they're often weird. They're often things like, do we steal stuff from the bodies? No. Do we reuse coffins? No. And it would also be more difficult, I think. The biggest one is about the logistics, about what happens from when a person dies to when they're either buried or cremated or put to rest. What people don't realise is that laughter at a funeral is more common. Things don't stop being funny when they're dark. This isn't just a play about death. It's also about trying to find your place in the world as a 25-year-old who may have lost a bit of direction along the way. It's a play for that generation that's starting to butt up against what milestones mean to them, about what success means to them, about what compromise is in their careers. It might be for people who've never thought about their funeral and can do that one good thing for their family of just telling them what they want. A lot of people who don't have that answer always feel like they've made the wrong choice. It's the simplest form of what we want to do in theatre is, is to provoke and elicit change in people, which is a great space to talk about those conversations that are often too big to talk about in any other form.